Have you ever pondered how animals in the wild manage to catch their meal? In the vast and diverse kingdom of wildlife, the quest for survival is a compelling saga of strength, strategy, and sometimes, sheer luck. At the heart of this saga is the intriguing world of animal hunting, a testament to the relentless cycle of life and death that has shaped evolution for eons. Hunting is not just about the thrill of the chase or the satisfaction of a full belly. It's a complex interplay of instincts, skills, and adaptation. It's about survival, not just of the individual, but of the species. It's about maintaining the delicate balance of ecosystems, where each creature plays a crucial role. In this relentless pursuit for sustenance, animals employ a wide array of hunting techniques. Each technique is as unique as the creature that wields it, shaped by their habitat, physical attributes, and the prey they pursue. From the stealthy ambush of the tiger to the cooperative tactics of a wolf pack, from the lightning-fast strike of the peregrine falcon to the patient trap set by the spider, the diversity of these strategies is truly astounding. Some animals rely on brute strength and speed, others on cunning and stealth. Some hunt alone while others work together in groups. Some chase their prey down while others lie in wait. The methods may vary, but the goal remains the same, to catch and consume their prey, ensuring their survival in the wild. As we delve into the world of animal hunting, we'll witness nature's raw, unforgiving, yet awe-inspiring spectacle. We'll discover the ingenuity and adaptability of creatures big and small, their relentless drive to survive, and the intricate balance of life on our planet. So, let's dive deeper and explore the fascinating hunting strategies employed by different creatures in the wild. Imagine being able to blend into your surroundings perfectly. Sounds like a superpower, right? Well, in the animal kingdom, this superpower is very much real. It's the art of stealth and ambush, a hunting technique employed by some of the most fascinating predators on our planet. Let's delve a bit deeper into this intriguing world. Picture a leopard, its spots mimicking the dappling of sunlight through the leaves. It moves with a silence that belies its power, each step carefully placed to avoid the rustle of leaves or the snap of twigs. It's a master of camouflage, using its coat to blend into the environment seamlessly, becoming virtually invisible to its unsuspecting prey. The leopard strategy is a game of patience and precision. It waits, perfectly still, for the opportune moment to strike, and when it does, it's swift and decisive, leaving no chance for its prey to escape. This is the art of the ambush predator, a technique honed through millions of years of evolution. Now let's consider another stealthy hunter, the crocodile. This creature uses a different environment to its advantage, the water. Submerged just beneath the surface, it's nearly indistinguishable from a floating log. The crocodile patiently waits, its eyes and nostrils the only parts of its body breaking the surface. It's a picture of stillness, a deceptive calm before the storm. When a potential meal comes to the water's edge, the crocodile strikes. In a split second it lunges from the water, its powerful jaws snapping shut. The attack is over almost as soon as it began, a testament to the crocodile's prowess as an ambush predator. These stealthy hunters, the leopard and the crocodile, use their environment and an uncanny patience to their advantage. They blend in, they wait, and when the moment is right, they strike. Their tactics are a lesson in patience, in waiting for the perfect moment, and in the element of surprise. These masters of disguise teach us the art of patience and the element of surprise. Ever thought of the thrill of the chase? In the animal kingdom, it's a matter of life and death. In the vast wilderness, we find animals that rely on their sheer speed and impressive endurance to catch their prey, turning the hunt into a high-stakes chase. Notable among these are the wolves and cheetahs, two species known for their remarkable hunting prowess. Wolves, for instance, are built for long-distance pursuits. With their lean bodies and powerful legs, they can keep up a steady trot for hours on end, gradually wearing down their prey. They embody the concept of persistence hunting, a strategy where the predator uses its superior stamina to outlast its prey. It's a grueling test of endurance, but for the wolf, it's a proven method of securing a meal. On the other end of the spectrum, we have the cheetah, the epitome of speed in the animal kingdom. Unlike the wolf, the cheetah's strategy is all about the sudden explosive chase. This big cat can accelerate from 0 to 60 miles per hour in just a few seconds, a feat unmatched in nature. Such breathtaking speed allows the cheetah to close in on its prey before the latter even has a chance to react. However, this incredible burst of speed is an energy-intensive process, so the cheetah must make every second count. 
These chase and capture hunters have evolved to be perfectly suited to their hunting style. The wolf, with its tireless perseverance and pack cooperation, and the cheetah, with its unparalleled speed and precision, both show how nature has fine-tuned these animals for their respective roles. They serve as prime examples of how speed and endurance can be utilized in the wild, demonstrating the intricate balance between predator and prey. These hunting methods may seem drastically different, but they share a common theme, the relentless pursuit of survival. Whether it's the long, drawn-out chase of the wolf or the swift, decisive sprint of the cheetah, these animals remind us that in the wild, every hunt is a battle of endurance, speed, and strategy. The chase and capture method shows us that sometimes persistence pays. Who said teamwork only applies to humans? Indeed, the animal kingdom is teeming with remarkable examples of cooperative hunting. Let's delve into this fascinating phenomenon. Take, for instance, the majestic lions of the African savanna. Known as the kings of the jungle, these big cats are also kings of collaboration. A typical lion pride consists of about 15 members, and when it's time for a hunt, each takes on a specialized role. Some lions stealthily encircle the prey, while others launch the attack. This strategy not only increases their chances of a successful hunt, but also strengthens the bonds within the pride. Now let's dive beneath the waves and meet the dolphins, another exemplary species that practice cooperative hunting. Dolphins employ a hunting technique known as herding. A group of dolphins will surround a school of fish, forcing them into a tight ball. Then, one by one, each dolphin takes turns darting through the ball, feasting on the panicked fish. This hunting strategy not only ensures a plentiful feast, but also requires incredible synchronization and communication among the dolphins. Cooperative hunting is not simply about securing a meal. It's a complex behavior that requires coordination, communication, and trust, elements that contribute significantly to the social structures within these species. For lions, a successful cooperative hunt reinforces the hierarchy within the pride. For dolphins, it strengthens social bonds and promotes unity. In the grand scheme of nature, these examples of cooperative hunting showcase the intricate balance and interdependence that exist within species. It's not just about survival of the fittest, but also survival of the most cooperative. The ability to work together, strategize, and communicate effectively is as crucial to these animals as it is to us humans. These animals demonstrate that there is power in unity and cooperation. It's a testament to the fact that in the wild, as in life, teamwork truly makes the dream work. Scene script. Picture this. An architect and a hunter rolled into one. Seems improbable? Not in the animal kingdom. In the diverse world of nature, we find creatures that combine the genius of an architect with the cunning of a hunter. These animals, like spiders and antlions, create intricate traps to ensnare their unsuspecting prey, showcasing an incredible fusion of intelligence and patience. Spiders, for instance, are the quintessential trap-making predators. They weave elaborate webs, a testament to their architectural prowess. These webs, often spanning several feet, are not just homes, but deadly traps. Their silken threads, thin yet incredibly strong, are coated with a sticky substance. Any insect unfortunate enough to wander into this trap finds itself ensnared, unable to escape. The spider, feeling the vibrations of its struggling prey, quickly moves in to secure its meal. On the other hand, we have the antlions. These small insects are not as well known as spiders, but their hunting strategy is no less fascinating. Antlions dig conical pits in sandy areas, creating a trap for ants and other small insects. When an unsuspecting ant stumbles into this pit, the loose sand gives way, causing the ant to slide down towards the waiting antlion. Any attempt to escape only triggers more sand to collapse, leading the prey back to the predator. These trap and capture predators highlight the extraordinary diversity of hunting strategies in the wild. They show us that not all hunters rely on speed or strength. Some, like the spider and antlion, use their intelligence to craft intricate traps and patiently wait for their prey to come to them. These creatures remind us that sometimes, the best strategy is to let your prey come to you. As we've seen, the animal kingdom is full of incredible hunting techniques. We've journeyed through the stealth and ambush tactics of predators, with their patient stillness, waiting for the perfect moment to strike. We've seen chase and capture hunters, whose speed and precision turn the act of hunting into a high-stakes race. We've witnessed the power of cooperation, as some species band together to hunt, showing us that unity is strength, even in the wild. 
and we've marveled at the ingenuity of trap and capture predators who turn their environment into a hunting tool. These techniques, as varied and unique as the animals who employ them, are all crucial for survival. Each strategy, each skill, and every instinct is a testament to the intricate and fascinating dance of life and death in the natural world. So next time you watch a nature documentary, remember, the hunt is not just about the catch, but also the strategy, skill, and survival instinct behind it.